then we took the first set from Fisher, and then they started to fight back, and then we had to fight back late in the late in the game. And then uh, overall, they took that. So I think just going into this weekend against Marymount, um, it just we can't take them lightly. We got to study what they do and just pre be prepared for anything and go in with high energy. It was intense. It was emotional. It was uh, everything that you expect out of a UGC tournament. The stakes are high, so the teams are going all out. Um, it's really do or die for many teams. Lucky for us, uh, we were able to get another shot with the at-large bid, but you know, it's it's do or die, so it's high stakes. I think so far it's pretty good. You know, when we play our best, like there's definitely not one team in the country that can come close to stopping us. It's just we have to keep that level of energy you know those those seniors that left uh, really left a legacy for us and I think the, these guys did a great job of keeping that up and pushing our starters every day in practice and, and just keeping us up so we could have as successful a season as possible you know we we got bailed out we got a second life they picked us to go to the tournament for a reason hopefully the fans don't count us out we're, we're still here we're still here We love the fans, we love the support. I'd like to say thank you to each and every one of them. We appreciate it and um, you know, any support we can get is great.